Hi everyone, my name is Mayank and I'm the Head of Developer Advocacy here at Vulture. In this tech talk, we are joined with Mridul and we are going to talk about building applications to leverage open source, pre-trained artificial intelligence and machine learning models. Hi everyone, my name is Mridul Soru and I'm a Developer Advocate here at Vulture. In today's tech talk, we are going to discuss how you can leverage open source AI ML models for building applications. AI and ML models are like smart tools that can predict outputs to a prompt by learning the patterns in the given dataset. They are based on vector embeddings, which means they map words and phrases with numbers so that a machine can understand them. These models are capable of utilizing knowledge from pre-trained models to solve new or related tasks and they are also adaptive, which means they can perform reliably across diverse environments or domains, making them versatile and suitable for various real-world applications. Transformers and diffusers are two great examples of the capabilities of these models. Transformers grasp context in language tasks like understanding and generating sentences. They are used in chatbots, translations and more. Diffusers handle complex data patterns and are capable of understanding intricate relationships in different formats of data. They are used in generating artifacts like images, audio, files and more. Now let's understand various types of AIML models. First we have a supervised learning models. It is like teaching with clear examples, for instance showing pictures of cats and dogs and telling the computer which is which. Second, we have our reinforcement learning models. It is like playing a game in which computer tries to learn by trying out different moves and getting rewarded for the good ones. And the last we have our unsupervised learning models, which is like finding groups of similar things without being told what they are. Now let's have a look at some real world applications of these AIML models. Object detections has numerous real world applications. It is used in autonomous vehicles to detect pedestrians, traffic signs and other vehicles ensuring safety. In retail, it helps with inventory management, tracking products on shelves and preventing theft. Additionally, it's used in surveillance systems for security, identifying individuals or objects in a monitored area. You can use models built on residual neural networks, more commonly known as a ResNet to detect objects in an image. You can also use VIT or CVT models to achieve the same. Semantic search is another real world examples of AI ML models. Semantic search is prevalent in various platforms like search engines, e-commerce websites and content management systems. It helps users find more precise and contextually relevant information by understanding the intent behind their queries. You can implement semantic search in your organization by converting the documents into embeddings and storing them in a vector database, which then can be used to run queries. To implement this solution, you may refer to the documentation linked in the description box. One of the most common use cases in today's world are personalized chatbots. By integrating your proprietary knowledge base into chatbots, you can offer a more personalized, efficient and consistent experience to customers, employees and other stakeholders, ultimately improving engagement and satisfaction levels. Chatbots can be built from scratch or be based on a pre-trained large language models using fine-tuning methods. You can find a wealth of knowledge about various different large language models like Meta's Llama 2, MPT, Falcon and more link in the description box. Remember, these are just a few applications of how AI ML models can be used in the real world. There are many areas where these models are being used to improve and optimize workflows and services. Now the big question is where to find these open source AI ML models. You can find open source AI ML models on the NGC catalog which is a repository by NVIDIA hosting powerful AI ML models optimized for NVIDIA GPUs, easing deployment for developers. Hugging Face that hosts a vast collection of open source AI ML models 
with contributions from a diverse community and GitHub, which also offers a wide range of AI ML models and tools fostering collaboration and customization. Now let's have a look at what Hugging Face Model Hub, GitHub and NGC Catalog looks like. So I am at the Hugging Face Model Hub where you can see there are almost 3 lakh models listed. Here you can find models for your specific use case or you can go to a specific model card by typing in the name and selecting the model. So here I have the specific model card for each model is available at the Hugging Face Model Hub. This is how NVIDIA NGC catalog looks like. Here you can find very popular models and collections for your particular use case such as automatic speech recognition, CUDA toolkit and DeepStream. There are GPU accelerated popular containers also which you can use to build GPU accelerated applications and scale them. GitHub also has a large collection of machine learning model repositories with it. So here are over 200 repositories from where you can select models for your particular use case and just start building on them. You can also deploy AI ML models with Virtual GPU Stack or VKE in form of pluggable APIs using solutions such as Hugging Face Text Generation Inference, VLLMs, TorchServe, TensorFlow Serving, NVIDIA Triton or even custom built applications using frameworks like FastAPI. Building a background task queue with a pub sub broker approach is also popular. While using LLMs, you need to ensure that you respect each model's licensing terms. Not all open source models permit redistributions or commercial use. Typically, open source models fit for commercial purposes include an Apache 2.0 license that allows commercial use, modification, distribution, and patent use without extensive restrictions. It provides permissions for sub-licensing and private use but requires preservation of copyright and license notices, an MIT license that permits almost unrestricted use for commercial and non-commercial purposes. It allows users to do anything with the code, provided the original license and copyright notices are included. Lastly, we have GNU General Public License, which allows free use, modification and distribution but mandates that any derivative work also be open source and under the same license. Here is a demonstration of how you can use Docker and pre-trained AI ML models to build APIs of your own. Now these are the commands for my Docker container and here I am running my Docker container giving it all the GPU access it requires. Now we are going to infer the model to generate responses. As you can see, I have asked the model what is deep learning and it has given me a very appropriate answers. I have used Hugging Face text generation inference to build an API for my AI ML model. As mentioned previously, you can also use many other methods to build APIs and plug it in your own products. Just to recap, today we discussed about AI ML models, their types and how to use or find them. In our upcoming tech talks, we will cover containerizing AI ML models for scalable deployments, so stay tuned. This was Mridul Swaroop and I hope to see you in the next tech talk.